Great oogly boogly do we got a fucking video for you today, man. That's an old reference off some shitty kids show back in the day with like a retarded dolphin or whatever the fuck he is. God, is he retarded? Hey, Brad, man, that word is offensive. Listen up, you little hero. I've been diagnosed with a lot of things in my life that I think classifies me as grade A retarded. So now that we're making it, I think I'm going to flaunt that a little bit. And if you get the reference, leave a comment down below. Of course, y'all know the name Brad Fam is real, real strong. We're marking the game the greatest of all time. Y'all the motherfucking goats. Speaking of goats, have you guys ever looked out your window and just thought, wow, that's a nice ass on that goat? Let me have it. Me neither, that'd be fucked up all the time. Now getting into it faster than Rob Kardashian allegedly came into Black China many, many times. There's another reference there. We're gonna get into the fucking video. Y'all have heard of surprise boxes in your life. And for those of you who don't know, pretty much it's a box where you get a bunch of clothing in it and you don't know what's inside it. I know what's inside it, but you guys don't. AKA it's a surprise box for you. I'm excited for this one, man, but we got one question at hand. Name brand. How in the mother of dick you about to open up that box? You box? You pussy? You beef curtain? You meat locker? You clammy vagina? There it is, bro. I learned this wrestling move I'm about to show you back in Nam. Except I got kicked out because apparently you're not supposed to wrestle the soldiers. You're supposed to shoot them in the face. But it's fine. Now we make YouTube videos. Start! That was sick. God damn am I fucking, fucking, fucking excited for this one, man. Ah! Here we go, bro. So as you guys know, we're going to SneakerCon Dallas. Actually, I'm leaving tomorrow. I'm filming this on Thursday. See you all there if you're going to be there. However, when you go to Dallas traveling with SneakerCon, you make merchandise. The most hype merchandise anyone's ever fucking seen so you can make some money. So here's some fucking merch, man. I've been talking it up a lot. Let's just get into it, though, bro. So you guys know what it is already. I've told a lot of you guys and chill with name, bro. Anyway, here's the fucking merchandise, man. We got goat on the front. We got Merc in the game on the back. We got a fuck ton of them for Dallas. And actually, if you're watching this video right now, I'm going to give away three shirts. So if you guys want to win three shirts or one, I guess I'll give it to three different people. Leave a comment down below, thumbs up the video, and subscribe if you're new. Anyway, the merch talk. We got Goat on the front. I've been telling you guys about it, but never showed it. Merc in the game on the back. I'm going to be 100% honest with you guys, man. This is the most half-assed merchandise I've ever put out. Ever. I'm never going to lie to you guys. I didn't really take too much time thinking about it. Let's be real here. The font is fucking stupid, overplayed. However, I've been to many sneaker cons and people still selling shit with this font or making banks. So I'm like, if y'all motherfuckers still want that font on your shit, then I guess I'll do it too. 100% real once again. We're in this to make money and also if you guys wear my shirt, that's pretty chill too. Anyway, man, let me know what you guys think about this. Oh, here's a sick one. I got this one for cameraman Adam to wear. Blau, it says that on the front instead of goat because he's not a goat and then we got Merc in the game on the back So if you see my boy there say hi to him if you ask for a picture from him, man He actually fucking cries about it like he's so fucking happy. I think that's hilarious So we got that we got goat here and then we got an exclusive name brand one that I'll be wearing too If you guys are there, so I'm very very stoked to meet you guys in Dallas If you are gonna be there if not I'm going to LA and every other fucking city in the world That's not true. Blau, so here's the hoodie once again. We put goat on the front, but I I wanted it really small. I don't think anyone wants goat really big across their tits. So we got that on the back of it. We got that. I think this looks real nice, bro. Uh, let me know what you guys think about it. If you guys want to win it, let me know. Basically, that's a whole box of just merch. I spent 600 bucks on this, and I'm hoping to at least triple my money. We're always going to be transparent with you guys, man. This, this channel costs a lot of money. I'm pretty much in debt right now, so anything I can do to get a buck from you guys is awesome. Also, I love you guys. You know that. Quick video. We're not going to make it fucking 10 minutes because it doesn't really matter. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you think about the merch, though. Really, because honestly... I think the fonts are so stupid and overplayed, but I also think that it did come out well. Goat, Merc in the game. What should we do for LA though? Leave your creative responses down below, and yes, I will put a penis on it if you wish. Name brand fam, real, real strong. We're Merc in the game, the greatest of all time. Y'all the motherfucking goats. Also in Dallas, we're going to be doing another custom on stage. Always stoked for that. We're going to have an Ultra Boost and some NyQuil and DayQuil. We're going to chug both of those so we get high as fuck. Then we're going to get another NyQuil and DayQuil bottle and pour on the shoes so that'll be really sick thank you guys so much for watching love y'all to death we real strong man look at the fucking sweat bubbles on me jesus christ this is what happens when you do crack coke